a visual artist and so it becomes a visual arts form um, that I bring into the neighborhood as projects, so art projects um, designed around um, the needs of the community. Art fan is my art form, and so it's ever changing and I'm an artist and it's what I've been, I've been born. So um, this culminates all of my experiences as an illustration major, going from there four years ago or more, um, you know, New York, selling art, making art, meeting artists, working in the studio, to community work, to grad work, um, hospital settings as an artist, you know, this kind of culminates all of it together. So where this will go, I don't know. My name is Jennifer Wilkie and I'm the program coordinator for Art Band. I've always used my own artwork to sort of deal with personal issues and understand things that are happening around me. So I had that sort of art therapy component even though I'm not trained as an art therapist. I say they act very positively. I do. And I think that, um, you know, there's some kids who may not come, like there's the young boy who came today who says, I've never participated in this before, Anthony came. Yeah, I, the way I describe it is when we come into the neighborhoods, it's kind of like an ice cream truck. <laughs> Except they're screaming, our bad, and come running after us. <laughs> I think so, as long as they keep paying me. <laughs> no, it's a great, it's a great job, and um, I'm very fortunate and really rewarding work. And I enjoy being here. I get to make art every day, so I can't ask for much more. We ex keep expanding our programming, um, doing two neighborhoods and a middle school program in Bath, two days at Perryman in Brunswick. We do Lewiston and Auburn and Saco and Biddeford. So it's always growing. We've never had vandalism that would show that you know, we don't want you here. Um, you know, we've had some kids who get angry and walk because we've set some limits on their behavior and have some TV. Mm -hmm. And they'll get angry back and say, you know, kids can be social, whatever. And, you know, and they are welcome to come back after they calm down and the next visit and they come back and hi. You know, I have a vision that it would go to one of the two of the art band youth that either go off to college or go traveling or work and then come back and that they take it over, like the next generation. And because I see it as an art form, I mean, for me, I just have my only hopes is that it keeps that vision of opening minds uh, and, and not being rigid. Um, it's a lot of work and you sort of end up doing everything from, you know, the basic of like cutting down paper for projects and, you know, if we're doing letters of appeal to fundraise, you know, you're looking stamps and sealing envelopes to design work to working with the kids and planning projects and driving the van. Like you're sort of engaged in the whole process and you work a lot to fundraise and raise money. So you have to be willing to sort of get your hands dirty and do various jobs and be really dedicated. Hi, my name is Donald Bromley and I'm 11. My name is Isla and I'm nine years old. I'm Christiana, I'm eight years old. Ashley Grace Bacana, and I'm six. Dylan, and I'm seven. Hi, my name is Anaya Jane Lee Burns, and I'm eight. Brittany May Geis, and I'm nine years old. Uh, well, I really don't do what they tell you to do. I just kind of wander off in my own world and draw what I want. Can you get to work? Can you get to make friends? Make me. Yes, it's fun and it's really cool. Cause you can you do whatever you want in art.